mama told me uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, come on My mama told me One day I'ma grow up big and I'ma be a king And my papa told me It's okay to say your shit hurts Don't forget your dreams cause they'll get you through this So called life, they call living what I call it strange And I bet I'll do it Cause I'm on my way and strong enough that yeah. I can shake the pain Hey, Mr. Sunshine, Mr. Rainstorm Meet me in the conference room, we need to brainstorm Need some middle ground, need an even kill But you were all pick up sides, give me fever chills Take them both like my food shot Good guys, it is Monday, February 6th. Today, I will be going to Redstone, Alabama. I don't like the way that this is angling. I feel like y'all can't see me. Come on. Got it. There it goes. Let's go. Go to school right here. Yes. There it goes. So, I'm going to Redstone, Alabama today. Or Red Flag. I don't know. Something Alabama, and today is my travel day. My flight is supposed to be leaving like around 10:30, so right now it's 7:15. I actually have to go check on my coworker's cat because he doesn't live here. He lives in Fort Hood, Texas. Bat has an apartment here, which is fucking crazy. Oh, that's weird. Um, I'm definitely not excited to go all the way to Alabama. To be honest with you. My flight leaves from where I live to Dallas, from Dallas to Alabama. So I gotta be on two planes today, and I hate fucking flying. I cannot stand flying. Just like the feeling that you get whenever you're about to take off, it is the worst feeling ever. Little interesting story that happened to me. I was coming out the gym, minding my own business. I was chilling. Oh fuck. <laughs> I was minding my own business coming out the fucking gym and I got pulled over. Like literally, I got inside my fucking car and all I see is whoop whoop and the fucking lights go off. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? And this fucking cop gets right behind me. I'm all like, okay, what did I do now? So I'm wondering, I'm wondering what the fuck I'm doing. I mean, I think that motherfucker's a hater because he sees, you know, a young person in an okay fixed up car and he's just like, fuck this kid. Now, nah, motherfucker, fuck you because whenever you saw my military ID, you're like, oh shit, my bad. Anyways, got inside my car, turn it on, turn on the lights. Y'all know that HIDs take a minute or so to warm up to their true color. That's the same thing for my license plate light. So, motherfucker pulls me over, uh, pulls me over, and I get out the car because I'm fucking pissed. And he tells me, "Do you know why I pulled you over?" I'm like, "For what, jackass?" I didn't really say that, but that's what my head was thinking. I'ma come back to Shell to get a fucking rock star because I'm craving a rock star right now. Anyways, so pulls me over. Tells me that he needs to see my license registration. I'm like, all right, cool. Pull it out, give it to him. He is all like, uh, the reason why I'm pulling you over is because your license plate light is blue. Like in my head, I'm just like, it's a fucking HID guy. It's an LED light. You're supposed to give it a little bit of time to warm up and then it turns white, you know? But no, he decided to give me a fucking ticket. So on the 15th of February, let's see this fucking bitch right here. 15th of fucking February, I gotta go to fucking court from where I live at. And you better fucking believe I'm gonna fight that shit. Because there's no way in hell I'm paying another fucking ticket this year. Well, I haven't got it pulled over this whole year. I know it's only two months, two months, but that's something to be proud of. Because I get pulled over at least once a month. Which is fucking pathetic and sad, to be honest with you, but, you know, whatever. You, you, you just gotta hit me tick. What the fuck are you doing? Ooh, motherfucker. I swear to God. Anyways. So, yeah, I'm pretty 
fucking disappointed. Um, the, I got something planned to buy. So, I know y'all can hear the freaking squeak on my freaking brakes. So, I've been making a little bit of research. I'm going to fix the brakes so they can stop squeaking all the fucking time. And also, I am going to buy some new rotors and discs. Oh my gosh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Please shut the fuck up. I'm going to buy some new discs and rotors. That's going to be the next project for um, the car. Um, I'm actually thinking about buying a budget turbo. Just because. Just because just, just I want y'all to experience like a cheap turbo versus at the end of the year hopefully a very very expensive turbo so I know I'm, I am gonna be wasting a little bit more money but I want to accomplish the goal of this year that I want to have a turbo on this car by the end of this year K Pro is gonna have to hold off a little bit because I would rather have this car like working perfect without you know freaking brake squeals and just little things here and there and then put in the freaking what's it called um put it on the uh the k pro but that is coming a little bit shortly i'm thinking about buying uh a new gopro too just so i can have two um so i can record with but yeah today is going to be just a little vlog i guess you can say i hope y'all enjoy it thank you for looking at my freaking uh what's it called um videos i I never thought my videos would get past 100 views, but I'm getting regular, regularly at least more than 150 views each each video. So thank y'all for that. For real, for real, thank y'all. I never thought that, you know, I will actually start getting like a following. Now there, now there is 67 of y'all motherfuckers that like to see me. Now, like I said, I'm keeping my word at 100 subscribers, I will be doing a giveaway. It's not going to be a lot, but it's going to be something, you know what I'm saying? But hopefully y'all enjoy it. I'm thinking about doing it like doing it like Rice Gum style. If y'all know Rice Gum, whenever he does giveaways, he wants everybody that, you know, views him to have a fair chance. So I'll probably just do a little bam, 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 and then pop up some Amazon, you know, codes and shit. So hopefully I can buy myself something. So that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Alright, cool. Anyways, um, I'm going to go take care of this fucking cat. I fucking hate cats, but that's my battle buddy, so I'm going to make sure that his pet is okay. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Ah, fuck. God damn it. Where the fuck? Oh my god. Oh, shit. Fucking asshole. What up, puss ball? Don't be looking at me like that. Fucking smack me. Look at you, fucking ugly ass. Man, you still got a lot of food. That shouldn't have fucking care. Just kidding. I hate you. Look at, look, look at, look at this motherfucker. Look. Say what's up, Tom Tom. Furry motherfucker. I don't really hate cats, to be honest with you. Uh, I don't hate them, I just dislike them. Bro, you haven't been eating. What the fuck is wrong with you? I just came back. This is like the fourth day I don't come. What the fuck? You need to be eating. Oh yeah, but you eat these treats, tell motherfucker. He's, what? Why do you always knock? This motherfucker always knocks off his fucking water. Shit's so annoying. Alright, I'm not gonna take you out to the restroom because that thing is always like a shit show.
think his owner was here. That's why he has like food and water and all that shit. <laughs> If y'all don't fuck with Kid Cudi, I can't fuck with him. I really can't. I'm just kidding. So, little funny story with this fucking cat. Whenever I first fucking took care of this fucking cat, he scared the shit out of me. Like, I almost literally peed myself. Because he was hiding, because he didn't know me. He didn't know me yet. So he was hiding. And I saw him run to this corner. But whenever I checked the corner, he wasn't there anymore. <clears throat> so I was like, what the fuck? You know, where did you go? So, you know, I'm like carefully stepping, being like a little pussy. You know, trying not to get attacked by this fucking cat. And, you know, one of my sergeants, he's with me. And I'm putting water into this little thing, right? And I turn around and like, you know, in the living room, this, the couch is like, you know, just right there. And I turn around and I see just him just, just sitting there being like a little bitch. And I was like, oh shit. And my fucking, sorry, he starts fucking laughing his ass off. And I was like, dude, I almost fucking shit myself. He was like, God, you're such a pussy. And I'm like, ha ha ha, funny ass punt. Anyways, kind of a dumb story, but. I don't know, I thought it was pretty funny whenever I almost literally pee myself while taking care of this freaking cat. Uh, uh <laughs> no, there's traffic on the way back to my apartment. Alabama. Um, I'm fucking tired. 
those two flights were really, really painful because there's this fat fuck next to me in the first plane ride, and he was like taking up my fucking chair. Like we had like the little thing up, and like I was sitting down like this, like just trying to avoid that motherfucker. But oh my god, um, we made it safe, guys. It was a pain up, but I wasn't able to get any clips for. Um, for video wise because I was like next to the freaking lane the whole time I wasn't even able to sit right next to the to the mirror but we made it I'm freaking tired I haven't ate all day I'm gonna go get myself some Chipotle and I'll see you guys another day I am I'm beat so you yeah, have a nice day please like and share comment down below whatever y'all think about my plans, plans about the car but uh, yeah, good talking to you guys. See y'all later.